Overcoming Stage Fright. Connect with your audience. Hello learners. Today, we are going to discuss a very crucial aspect of public speaking and presentations, connecting with the audience. This technique can be a powerful way to manage stage fright and anxiety. We'll explore why it's important, how to do it, and some practical tips to get you started. So, let's dive in. Before we jump into the techniques, it's essential to understand why connecting with your audience matters. When you're public speaking, your audience isn't just a passive group of listeners. They're an active part of your presentation. When you connect with your audience, you're not just talking at them, you're talking with them. This creates a sense of engagement, makes your presentation more enjoyable, and, most importantly, helps you to alleviate stage fright because you're no longer speaking to a group of strangers, but rather to an engaged community. One of the most effective ways to connect with your audience is by making eye contact. This is a universal sign of engagement and interest. It makes your listeners feel seen and heard, while also helping you to appear more confident and composed. Practice this by dividing your audience into different sections. Periodically, shift your gaze from one section to another, making sure to look at different individuals. Remember, though, that you don't want to stare or make anyone uncomfortable. Quick, frequent eye contact is what you're aiming for. Audience participation is another powerful tool to create a connection. This could be something as simple as asking rhetorical questions, encouraging people to raise their hands in response to a question, or asking for a volunteer to come on stage. Remember, the goal here is not to put anyone on the spot but to involve your listeners and make them feel a part of the presentation. This involvement can greatly help reduce your anxiety as it shifts some attention away from you. People connect with stories and real-life examples more than abstract concepts. Sharing personal anecdotes or relevant examples not only makes your presentation more interesting, but also allows the audience to relate to you on a personal level, creating a deeper connection. It makes your presentation more human and engaging. Finally, be yourself. People can easily tell when someone is being disingenuous. Authenticity builds trust, and when your audience trusts you, they're more likely to engage with you and your content. So let your personality shine through your presentation. Well, that's all for today, folks. I hope you find these techniques helpful and they aid you in connecting with your audience, thus managing your stage fright effectively. Remember, public speaking is a journey, not a destination. Each presentation is a new opportunity to connect, learn and grow. So keep practicing, and soon enough, stage fright will be a thing of the past. Happy learning!